Mike is hot. Dan is hot. <laughs> Dan is really hot right now. That award's looking hot. Dude, I'm, yeah. I'm about to, I'm definitely bringing it up. Hey, yeah, you can see it. Awesome. Oh, you uh, can see it. All right, cool. What's up? This is the Tuesday show. I'm Ultra David. I'm Say Rice. Oh, I'm Katana Prime. What's up? And I'm James Chen. How's everybody going? Uh, no Steves this week. They are busy folks, but we got a couple of special guests here, as you can see. Uh, we're going to be talking about Injustice 2. It's been out for a week. What do we think so far? We're going to be talking about some tournament results. A bunch of stuff happened. Uh, this weekend is the craziest weekend coming up. The coming up weekend is the wildest. Um, hold on. Before anything, <laughs> why is Dan riding the Cannon Award? Like, this is... Because you wanted him to ride the Cannon Award. <laughs> he's, 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 he's riding the Cannon... Like, look at... Okay, hold on. Let's at least make it right. All is well in the Street Fighter world. All right. Dan for season three, please. All right. You just got to keep your hand He there. can't even... I don't even get this. Whatever, man. Go ahead. Hey, actually, you <laughs> Well, he's not going to stay there for much longer, but, you know, that's, that's the way it can't works. can't really see his face, but he's enjoying it back there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, he's kind of looking... He's looking at David while he's riding the Cannon Award. He's got beady so. little eyes. It's a weird it's a weird view. I want a Cannon Award now. <laughs> Let's go. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, um... You want to start off with the injustice thing? You want to talk about this? I mean, what's going on? A lot of things are going on. The game has been out officially for a week. A week. Some folks may have had it for slightly longer. Than <laughs> the early access boys. Uh, yeah. That's so right. No, I, no, I don't know what you're talking about. I've had it for like a week and a half. <laughs> Some people have had it for two weeks, but you know, it's been out for a week. Uh, and we in have. that time, there have been a couple tournaments. Wednesday Night Fights, NLBC, other locals, Toryukin this past weekend, uh, and so we've had a chance to see it in tournament play as well as mm-hmm. just experiencing the game. Um, so, what are y'all's thoughts? What's going on here? I haven't played it much. Uh, I've only got to, I streamed it just a little bit, trying to go through training mode, mess with a couple of characters, figure out who I want to use. Um, I mean, I'm probably going to keep using Catwoman because I've played her in the sure. first one. Flash looks interesting. Uh, I just like Carla Quinn, the character. Uh, I didn't like her in, in... I didn't like the way she looked in Injustice 1, but I think she looks cooler in Injustice She looks sick. I, I didn't come here for Harley Quinn slander. So yeah, she didn't look that good before, just, like, sure. calm down That's on true. that a little bit. But she looks good now, please. Thank you. David? Now. Yeah. Not before. Not this before. is so bad. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't tell me this. Uh, and, and I'm also thinking of maybe trying out the Flash. Well, I mentioned the Flash, didn't yes. I? Uh, then, uh, oh, Poison Ivy I messed with a little bit. So. Mm. But uh, I think, because I, I wanted to pick one zoner. Oh, you I did. wanted to make sure I had one zoner in the game just to get used to the okay. zoning. Okay, all right, all right. But uh, I, I think that might be Harlequin instead of Poison Ivy. Cause... Poison Ivy's kind of a, have an odd duck. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Because she basically has an odd duck. <laughs> right? Just to throw poison, poison, poison at duck. you. Yeah, exactly. Plant, but, you know. Sure, let's call it a duck. I'm, a, I'm okay with this. <laughs> Everyone has. Plant, but hey, yeah. maybe, if maybe it walks like too. a plant and looks like a plant, then you call it a duck. <laughs> um, yeah. Works for me. Whatever works. I mean, it's personally, we all have to name it ourselves. Uh, so <laughs> if you want to call it a duck, James, we'll call it a duck. It, I was going to call it Seymour, but all right. I mean, this just looks like that thing from Mario. The little. Oh, the piranha plant. Yeah, that's the only thing I think about. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Petey Piranha? Sure, yeah. call it what you want. It's yours. <laughs> Personalize it. It should be a gear piece, and then you can turn it up and be cute, but yeah, it, it is what it is. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah um, let me just get my like small agenda out of the way. Wonder Woman sucks, so, oops. Outside of that, no, the game's <laughs> fun. We saw Toru Kin to get some decent tournament play for sure. Uh, the brothers are back. We had a Honey Bee and Biohazard Grand Finals, yeah. the classic up in Canada, and uh, they definitely put on the show. That's um, CRCR, right? Yes. Um, everyone's really afraid about the dead shot bug that's going around right now. Yeah, right. So one of the big things about the game yes. early on right now is that there's a lot of talk about zoning in Injustice 2 yes. and whether some of the characters are too good at it. Uh, yeah, I think before we get into that, though, let's maybe talk about... Well, I guess it's fine. Let's just jump into that. That's, that's cool. I was going to get initial impressions, but no big deal. Sure. Uh, I don't really feel like that. I'm not super worried about zoning. Obviously, it's good. Yeah. I don't want to say it's not good, but is it like everybody's going to be picking a zoning character? Everybody's That's what you have to pick in order to win? I really don't think so. I yeah. really don't think it's like that. I'm with you on it. Um, it's been a week now, and people are improving against that shot. It's I just one think week, two weeks, come on. The, the general, you know, NRS community hasn't, 
dealt with zoning at this level, you know, so far. So Deadshot's a bit overwhelming, especially for all the new guys coming in. He's the scrub killer. And uh, oh, definitely for yeah, yeah. sure, he's like killer. he's a scrub free. killer. He's a scrub killer. But um, we're starting to walk him down. I think I think by the time Gumball Breaker rolls around, we'll be fine, which is a few days, but. Just this weekend, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't think we'll get the, you know, we're all scared and, and we, you know, quick reaction tweet or complain because we lose three or four ranked matches to yeah. dead shot. And um, I think it'll be fine. I don't think we'll get six in top eight. But no. it might be handy to, like, you have to brush up against him now. Like, it's forced. Mm -hmm. If you don't, yeah. you're going to die. No questions. Well, I mean, I think Sammy's a scrub killer is a good way to put it because yeah. Everybody's a scrub in week one. Nobody is an expert at the game yet. Everybody's figuring it out still. Even if you played Injustice 1, you're, just, you're still like figuring it out to some degree because everything... there's uh, Nothing is exactly the same, right? There are tweaks yeah. to the game. So you got to view it as if you're coming into it like a scrub. And For sure. in beating people with that shot, I feel like that's been a big part of it. People are just not sure what their own options are yet. They're not sure what dead shots options are yet. Yeah. Not sure like what to do about zoning. Do you walk it down? Do you jump? Right. Do you meter burn roll? Yeah. Do you use interactables? Still early. Whatever. I mean, we're all. It's, it's really early. It's like very preliminary now, stuff. So. I mean, that isn't to say that he might not end up being the best. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> right? he's a really good character. Maybe in fact, I feel like there's more than even zoning to him. He has really good it, strings. Right. Uh -huh. and good yeah, it happens. And, and and but the whole point is, let it bake. Please been give a week. us give us it's like two months at least before you start going. Yeah, I mean, the granted, I've been crying about Wonder Woman and like just having fun with it, but I'm not asking for nerfs or buffs. Like seriously, just mm -hmm. let's let it rock. You know, the first premiere event to kick off the pro circuit. Like, can we get through that first and then? Right. Like, yeah, and see, see how it's we'll on. see what happens. I mean, if we if we end up with six Tanyas in top eight, you know, like then <laughs> we can talk about. No, like, that that's the. <laughs> No, the NRS curse is that that's reserved for CEO. That's oh, okay, what happens. The okay, broken okay. DLC character comes out before CEO, <laughs> yeah. and then we get Kenshi, and then we get yeah. you know Scorpion, oh, sure. and then we get Tanya. Let's let's chill out, James. All right, let's just, <laughs> but, you know, it's, maybe it's, this it's time just, we survive. It's not just Deadshot. Uh, Aquaman seems good, and Black Adam seems good. Oh, for and, sure. I mean, yeah. but those. I feel like the reason, part of the reason anyway, that those characters are common right now is that they're not that different than they were before. No. They're like mostly the same character so if you're jumping into a new game and it's in a tournament and you see a character that you used to play that's like mostly the same character easy to pick that character and mm -hmm. think that you can do well and probably Absolutely. do well so I feel like that's like two big things going on causing people to worry about zoning one that shot's probably pretty good yeah for sure but then also uh, <laughs> but then also like a lot of the returning characters who are not that different are zoners like they they do zone so those are the characters people are doing well because they are used to them. Yeah, I agree. Um, and it's one of the easier ones to start with. You know yeah. what I mean? I mean, think about it. When Marvel 3 first came out, Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 came out, people thought Ghost Rider was amazing because no one could get in on Ghost Rider because he was just whipping chains across the screen. And he turned out to be like one of the worst characters in the game. <laughs> so It's early. We'll figure it out. Yeah, uh, you yeah, know, the scene, out, the people, but, the new guys yeah. who we have no idea. You know, maybe Johnny Button sitting in his living room right now has all the answers. And he's going to come and mop everybody up and come up regular. Let's just and look, one step at a time. We'll in, be fine. In, in any case, Bane plus Deadshot mm -hmm. won Wednesday Night Fights. Yes. And then Toriyukun was won by Flash and, like, one game of Deadshot where he Which, got murdered. Yeah. <laughs> we're not, we're not gonna... Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we're not we're gonna... <laughs> and second place was Bane and uh, Harley Quinn. Oh, yes. So, uh, I'm not seeing much cause for concern yet. We'll see. Uh, are, you, are you playing this video game? Yeah, I, mean, I was about to ask. <laughs> I mean, you know, that's not my that's not my realm, so, like, mm -hmm. if everybody's wondering why I'm not saying anything, because, like, NRS is, like, Man, way on the other side of yeah. me. So, <laughs> it's so, all good. You know, I, I'm a spectator. Like, I'm a super casual in the game. Like, I'm not playing it right now. I plan on getting it along with, like, you know, Tekken 7 and yeah, other man, stuff coming out. it's all good, man. Play but what you play. if man. I did play, I'd probably play uh, yeah. Deadshot. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you see the smile he said that way? He, he thought about Cheeky feeling guy. bad, I mean, and then he just said, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm anyway. a scumbag. I mean, he's, he's winning right now, but, I mean... There's a couple of characters that look interesting, like Captain Cold. I like you. You just he looks sick. Oh, yeah, he looks, he looks uh, I like this one. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> he, looks, he looks interesting. Um, I like Dark Side. And, of course, I want to play Sub-Zero because, I mean, I play him in uh, Mortal Kombat every yeah. time I play. So, just kind of see. I wonder if Ice Clone is coming back. So Probably. Hopefully. Probably. I hope yeah. not. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> you think that, that they would not bring 
The clone bag? I feel like that's the guy that But isn't the clone, like, bugged, or, like, doesn't it, like, not... Does wow, it, does are you... Not are, does, it, does not function correctly? I, I did not come here for this, either. <laughs> like... <laughs> is, it, is it, um... Uh... Yeah. Anyway. Uh, um, so, I'm loving it so far. I've been playing Bane, Scarecrow, Fate, and Swamp Thing. Those are the ones that I've been focusing in on. Because I always like to have the Grappler and the Zoner, and Swamp Thing and Scarecrow are, like... Zoner grapplers. They're like these weird mid-range putsy characters with super far grabs, etc. Really funky characters. Uh, and I really enjoy both of them. I think they're good. I think all four of those characters are good, I should say. Um, I really like Bane still. I was worried at first when I saw that things like uh, Double Punch weren't in the back four two, mm -hmm. the overhead. It's not safe anymore, which it was previously. And I thought, like, man, does that mean I'm not going to be able to pressure anymore? But no. He is super good still. He is definitely super sick on pressure. Ridiculous vortex stuff. Yeah. Uh, you get a command grab knockdown and it's party time and it's <laughs> Break some bags, right, David? Yeah. Does that make you feel yes. like a man oh, when you're out I'm there so breaking happy. bags? Does so that make happy. you just bane bomb everybody? And... So sick, for yeah. sure. And and so I'm really enjoying him. Dr. Fate, I think, is super sick. I feel like he is the guile of the game, whereas Deadshot oh. might want to be like full screen doing these things. Mm -hmm. uh, Fate, I don't really think that's where he wants to be. I think he wants to be more like two-thirds or three-quarters screen, setting things up, and he's got all these weird options, and putting them all together is going to take a while. Yeah, sure. It'll be like an interesting project. Uh, really interesting character design. Uh, but I would say my favorite thing is Scarecrow, his trait, puts out poison gas. <laughs> God. Right? And yeah. that does damage over time. Okay. And there's nothing to be done about it. It's damaging you as the opponent while you're hitting Scarecrow. There's no way to get out of it. And he also has a teleport. Right, that I was just traps. Say, yeah. Right? So if you the opponent is down on life and you have some life, all you gotta do is turn that train on and you teleport right into them and they explode so and there's nothing to do. You see how hyped David no, gets no, about no. I was just about to <laughs> say, <laughs> you don't understand. When when oh, I used man, to play him in jerk. MKX, I used to use Lackey Tor, right? Sure. And he would use Kotal Khan. And if he got me down to no life, he would just put out the sun statue, and he would, sun. and he would cackle like oh, you yeah. can hear oh, him. Yeah. I'm not sure. David cackle. <laughs> I'm yeah, not that sure thing. I know yeah. who this man is. So when we talked about breaking backs and poison gas, like he got this extra little grin, like his you know lips just went out a little more than you. Who are you? Oh, dude. That's me, man. Someone actually said that they killed the opponent because the Terrible. opponent landed the death combo and was killing them, and he died by the trait. Sick. Oh, like, I will turn on, I will turn on trait and walk forward. And just, you, you want to punch me? Cool. See, yeah, I would have probably, probably cut the game off right there. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you know what you would People do? Have rage you would take your controller and slam it on the floor, and it would bounce across the now room. See, like, wow, how many wait, wait, wait. shots do you have, James? <laughs> Jesus, this gun. All right, so between... I'm dead shot, dude. I'm dead shot right now. Today I'm just like. Ooh. See, like if they didn't cost like they're like sixty dollars, man. Like that's a whole game. Like I'm not about to throw my controller. I'm sorry. <laughs> let's just cut the game off and then let's just go on about like. Uh, Would you do that in a tournament? Just cut it off? Nah, man. None, none of that, man. Like I, I wouldn't do it in a tournament, but like if I'm at the house. Like on a on a dead shot, I, I mean I see why they rage. Quick. I would probably rage quick too. Like I watch, like I watch the videos. I'm like, dang, I would be mad too. Like, like he's just spamming it. So I mean, it's like, dang. Like I mean, it sucks to be on that end, but I mean, I would rather be that guy spamming it than you know. Oh, be on that yeah, end. for sure. Yeah. For right, sure. Ice a scarecrow player, you know, confirmed here. So I love it. I love so it. So it does make. I guess it makes sense that you would use Captain Cold now that you mention it, huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Ice, Plus, ice. he looks cool too. Uh -huh. But I mean, you know, if Doctor Fate is like Gal. This shoot up. I feel like he's like yeah. <laughs> Captain Cole is not really like anybody, I would say. Like, he's a weird setup character. You put walls down, and you got a thing that freeze. There's this whole big blue part of the screen yep. that comes up that will freeze your character if you stay in it for too long. But there's a wall in front of you. Nah, the best so part is... So you can't get out, and you freeze. Oh, it's such a jerky move. The yeah. best part is you get the Mr. That's what, look, that's I'm, just, I'm just looking at him at this point. Like, he's so... Oh, look, this you is, know? This you see the double part. horns yeah, right, right now on the pitch this board? Is yeah. part oh, the so you're going to build the wall, and Arkham's going to pay for it? <laughs> Genius. <laughs> Genius. Uh, no, uh, honestly, it's a big part of why I like NRS games, because they always have bizarre stuff that I can for sure. do, and it's like... It's very satisfyingly jerky, bizarre stuff. And that I, that's a big part of why I play it, for sure. 
<laughs> this is why I don't play him in any fighting game. You yeah. understand? Because he just makes me rage quit all day. Who who knew that David was like the SoCal secret scumbag? Wow, is this and where everybody Paul... in SoCal? <laughs> yeah, I know. Man. Are you the Godfather scumbaggery? Uh, I mean, you guys Godfather. have been around for a while. You know, did you birth this new age of I'm scumbaggery? Maybe I might be up in that mafia, though. I'm not. not I'm not the Godfather. Oh, but I would okay. say, but I'm. Like an ambassador, like yeah, I'm up there somewhere. You know? <laughs> He's representing. I might, I might be the, I mean, might be the consigliere. I might the be the senator. You know, I learned something today, yeah. so I'm a happy man. Thanks. You know, I came out here for work, and then I got <laughs> lessons from Ultra David. Yeah, that's right. I learn more about uh, the FGC I, I, I every love, single day. <laughs> I'm, I'm really happy with it, and and even on top of the uh, the gameplay itself, is something we were talking about in the call yeah, right over. Right. Game is such a complete game. It's so it's such a good release. Oh, the, the about outside it, of the the actual game. Outside yeah, of the yeah, gameplay, yeah, yeah. which uh, I uh, again really like. Everything else about it is super sick. Uh, I love the gear system. Ridiculous. I love the guild system. You can have, you can be playing with people in a guild, and there's like rewards for playing with or against guilds mm-hmm. and getting all that stuff going. And the the gear is super cool, dude. I gotta tell you, like some of the things that Scarecrow has in particular are just. I, I love it. It's it, not usually the case that I care that much about graphics mm-hmm. in games. In fact, to be honest, a big part of my playing NRS games was because I don't care about graphics because I feel like they've all been terrible <laughs> until until now. Um, but that's a that's a big thing for me is that I I feel like I'm like designing my World of Warcraft character with like his gear. Yeah. But now it's in a fighting game, and, and that's I love that. Sick. Sick. Take your scumbaggery and just project it through all the characters yes. you play. I like oh, it. Yeah. Yeah. I have to deal with it. I got I got a I got a <laughs> scarecrow skin you can you can name all of your loadout skins. So I got one that's full of bones. You got bones everywhere. It's called Bonanza. Um and I got uh, See everyone thinks I'm the pun guy. <laughs> I right? can't, I can't, but, like, listen man, I'm Bonanza. this is a lesson. Bonanza. I know we're just casually talking and, and you know it is what it is, but this is a lesson in commentary right now from the God of scumbaggery who thinks puns in character loadouts are cool, so he laughs at them himself because no one can see these. (laughs) No, they can. (laughs) Yeah, if they go and look at your profile. As when you're when you're in character select, you can shuffle through the loadouts. Oh, are you one of those guys that just? And I will definitely go through my own loadouts. Oh my, yo, I'm out. (laughs) Peace. Yo, I'm out. Just so the opponent Peace. can see all my loadouts. Bonanza. Like, who are you? Oh, man. I go, like, that's one. Uh, there's Rotting Voldo uh, so far. Uh, I got one that ran out of space, so it's that MF and Scary C, because I couldn't fit the whole word, uh, unfortunately. Um, I, got, <laughs> I got Bane. Bane has one that's called Canadian Tuxedo, because it looks like he's just wearing denim. And then uh, there's one that... You don't know that? Oh, there's a I've joke never about... heard of it. I've never heard of it. <laughs> uh, yeah, that, that went over my head. Okay, so. well, these are white jokes. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm half white, and I still I missed all of it. I, I don't know. And then the last, last main one is called uh, is called Leafield Pouches because he's. Oh, you came. Yeah, 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 yeah. You go ahead, go ahead. We want to hear this. Uh, one. Go ahead. Uh, because he has pouches in the way that Rob Leafield does when he. Wow. Makes. Yo, <laughs> who's man? Serious, like. Can, we need the we need the whose man is this gift in the chat? Like, you know. <laughs> I mean, it's creative. I mean, I it lets you funny. express yourself. Like you're expressing yourself. See, that's what the game should let you do. <laughs> he says, "I think it's pretty funny." He hesitates and then laughs hysterically. I think it's pretty good. Uh, oh, that's why we love you. That is why we love you. Go I ahead. just can't wait to actually start playing the game. I just haven't had a chance. I've actually been playing a shit ton of Guilty Gear. Yeah, I mean, it's a good game. And there, there's yeah. so many, like, things to play. It's, it's the Golden Age, man. Like, that's yeah, a serious, sure. serious, it's, you know, it's praise. Weird. It's like, it's great, but at the same time, it sucks. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, honestly. Yeah. It's true, yeah. you got to make choices about where you're going to spend yeah. your time. It's not easy to know which one to put time in. Yeah, yeah. Same thing. It takes a lot of time, too. So. It does. <laughs> yeah. Even with Justin Justin, too, just with work and, and travel, having to do all this stuff, because I'm out here, you know, for right. shop and everything. And yeah. My job, I just grind whenever I can, but even then, like, I just don't have the time I used to. I mean, the I example I always give is, you know, freaking Tokido used to be at Evo walking around with, like, six medals hanging from his neck. Because he would get like top eight in Tekken, yeah. and he would get top eight in CVS two, and then in Third Strike, then in Super Turbo, and he would get top eight in like every game, and, like KOF. I mean, Tokido is kind of like the god. Like, yeah, <laughs> but the crazy thing is, he doesn't play anything except Street Fighter yeah. now because yeah. that's how much he has to dedicate to be competitive. Right. Crazy, yeah. you know, it's crazy. That's so, true. 
Yeah. Oh, man. Anyway, yeah, good things about the game so far. I'm happy about it. Yeah, happy absolutely. about the launch. Yeah, uh, definitely happy with launch. Man. So did you ever play the other NRS games by any chance? Yeah, I played Injustice 1. Um, I was playing in, playing Green Lantern. Like, I wouldn't, like, top tier or anything oh, like yeah, that. Okay. But, I mean, it was just so stiff for me that it was hard for me to really, like, get into it or whatever. Oh, yeah. yeah. But, but I, I mean, agree. like, you know, I always watch everybody's streams and stuff like that, like a Perfect Legend, Sonic Fox, and everything. Like, I still support it in other ways. I just don't actually play it because, I mean, I'm trash. I'm just going to be real. That's, okay. so, <laughs> That's cool, man. It is what it is, Everybody's man. Got yeah, 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 yeah. You know? yeah. You know, no, no but I'm, like, I'm trying to like expand out, like we talked about earlier. Like I'm, uh, Kizzy K has been kind of working on me with Guilty Gear yeah, and stuff like that. It's so i um, been trying to learn. It. It's just like overwhelming because it seems like a lot right now. But like like you said, like <laughs> yeah, once yeah. you start actually start playing um, it. Like once you start playing it, the bursts are going to make sense. Yeah. Especially because yeah. you're going to burst in the worst time possible. And you're <laughs> just going to be like, yep. nope, that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, and yeah, then yeah. you're dead. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Oh, man. But I yeah, like the bursts in Injustice, too. It's cool. I saw Air someone. escape. What's up? <laughs> I saw someone in the chat say, you know, they asked the question, who is Ice, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to put your Twitter picture up here. On my <laughs> no, no, not the blow up. I, I, I'm going to have to do it because I have to show people who Ice is. <laughs> Because this is important for people to see this here. Is, oh, is, is I secretly go. the guy from the uh, <laughs> from the was the Old Spice the Old Spice promotion? Yeah, I know, right? Is that you? I would I secretly. Would say, I would say I outdid him. I would say I outdid him. You outdid the Old Yo, Spice a, man. Yeah. Yo, you have like a baked in Halloween costume. <laughs> you rode yeah, a yeah. horse in the water. You're a god. That's yeah, you have like. a horse in the water. <laughs> like, like, like who so are you? Like so seriously, like, no, like, that's. So what, what was what was going on that there's a horse in the water? So, I mean, like basically this was <laughs> on my this was on my honeymoon, right? And like I said, man, I didn't even know like horses could swim. You know what I'm saying? And, like, <laughs> we went on land and stuff like that. We went on horseback riding on land. It was pretty cool. And then they're like, "Oh, you want to go in the water now?" I'm like, "On the water." You know what I'm saying? And then we went out there. We went out there pretty far, and I was like, "All right, man, this is far enough, man. We got to go back." So, <laughs> you know, so I mean, it's a pretty cool experience. You know. What I'm so saying? was that is the horse walking on sand or is the horse swimming? Well, at no, that point, is... at that point, it was coming back from swimming, so it was about to reach the sand, but it hasn't quite see, reached it. Yet. You can see it. It's so you can ride horses Yo, like they're a my boat. man's rode a horse in the water. Their horses are boats. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, they have to be trained, of course. You know what I'm saying? Like, so I, why I don't, no why don't? Is that the real tech? Because I like so, this is. But, but my question that now, I... if you're too big though, they'll throw you off. Because there's this big girl out there, man. They threw her straight off. Like the horses, like jumped that, and like she like fell in the water, and of course she didn't get well. back on. But I mean. <laughs> so why don't boats get measured in horsepower as well? That's I mean, a great it seems question. like it would work, right? Yeah, it seems like. Hey. I learned something new, man. I got like I felt. I, I, I thought that people new. had to yeah. invent boats to cross the water, but maybe they just rode horses back in maybe like thirty thousand years ago before <laughs> crossing the Bering Strait on a horse. Yeah, I, I don't know. So, I don't know. Know. so you man, guys, are, so that if you want to know who ICE is, that's who he is. <laughs> Life is that's, crazy, man. That's yeah, the yeah, guy. Life is crazy. Fighting games brought me to meet this man who rides horses in the water. <laughs> like, are you kidding me? Like, I'll pack it up. Like, <laughs> Yeah, I can dude. compete with that. Like, but I honestly, mean, I, I just want to say congratulations. Oh, yeah, yeah. Appreciate oh, yeah, it. Nice right. like so, yeah, yeah. Really good stuff, good stuff. So. <laughs> so can Aquaman talk with horses? <laughs> 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 well, why not, dude? Wow. He has so many extra powers. Oh, are you like, thought. are you Aquaman? Like, no. Nah, multiverse nah, 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 voice? I mean, in Justice 2 just came out. Yeah. Maybe in Earth, something, something. Yeah. Ice is secretly Aquaman, <laughs> and you're playing us right now? I'm not that cool. I, Aquaman, he, he got it, you know. So, uh, cool. I, I'll stick to land, really. I just want to yeah. make sure, you know, next premiere skin right here. Ice. Yeah, right. Yeah. 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 But, I mean, so... Just, obviously the game is a week old, right? Yeah. I mean, is, outside of, obviously, people thinking Deadshot is super good and Wonder Woman, you're saying, sucks, right? Yeah, I'm just, I'm just having fun with that, but go ahead. Yeah. She really doesn't seem that good. Yeah. How, it's okay. What, how else does it feel right now? Does it feel like that there's even kind of an inkling of, like, who's good and who's not? I mean, it, it's always easy to talk of, of what's popular. I mean, Black Adam does ridiculous right. damage off of any touch, so yeah. with that kind of output... He can't be bad, but right. um, yeah. you know, just the popular guys right now. I think there's so much to learn about all of the characters, and uh, even the less popular ones we aren't seeing, or the mid ones that we like, the firestorms, or yeah. the, you know, the colds. We we don't yeah. know, but we know top guys so, like like Dragon playing Ivy, or you know, I think Combo Breaker is going to reveal yeah. a lot. You think people are hiding tech for Combo Breaker right now? Oh, for sure. There's no way oh, to keep okay. up everything. No, there's just no way. You know, yeah, we don't yeah. know the secret cyborg player in right, Wyoming yeah, or something yeah. like that. And I would say on top of that, even if people are putting their tech out, there's so much coming out right now that yeah. it's hard to like actually see all of it. But and I mean, like, do you feel like 
you said Honeybee was playing Flash, right? Yes. Do you think he's using Flash because he doesn't want to reveal who his true main is? Oh, um, no, he loves Flash, yeah, so he's, 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 he's oh, going to okay, play him. Okay, he's okay. One, it's like me and Katana. It's like, we can talk as much as we want, but we're going to play said character at the okay. end of the day. Um, okay. I mean, I, I, like, certainly all the characters that I'm playing, those four, Swamp Thing, Scarecrow, Bane, and Fate, they all are good, for okay. sure. Like, they're, okay. like, I wouldn't say any of them are bad. And that's, that's how I felt playing against everybody so far, that I feel like there's at least some strength there. I, like, I haven't played <laughs> against anybody who... I feel is terrible. I feel like David is messing up his tech, right? Isn't Bane supposed to be really bad? Remember, <laughs> so in Injustice One, right? Yeah. And everybody was like, "Oh, Bane's terrible." Um, I said that too, but I thought he was super good, mm-hmm. and so I like fed along the, "Yeah, Bane's awful. Guy, he needs a patch so bad. He needs a buff so badly." And then they did buff him, and uh, he ended and up now it's called pretty good. now it's called the Bane treatment when someone gets yeah. overbuffed. Uh-huh. I wonder why. Yeah. <laughs> Now you know who oh, caused it. Now yeah, you I don't know about that, but I definitely fed into the same thing. <laughs> yeah. But no, he's definitely good. Yeah. Definitely good character. I mean, we'll see what happens. Uh, again, it's early. It's impossible to have all these matchups fleshed out, or you know who does what. Um, I would recommend people play multiple characters. It just seems yeah. that that's the route that Injustice mm-hmm. is going. Yeah. That you know the archetypes are so different, and you're gonna need X, Y, Z, depending on you know who who knows what. And with the patches that it will eventually come. It's always good to be ready yeah. with so much on the line. Now, we've never had a full-blown circuit like this where everything matters so much. Every place, 600, 600 big boys, yeah. you know, and uh, and, it, and it's not, you know, 50 events. You know, it's right. now until September. Okay. Right. Okay. Well, actually, I shouldn't say $600,000 because 300000 of that is going to Sonic Fox, right? <laughs> it's the other $300,000 oh, that's up for grabs <laughs> at this point in time. We'll see right? at Combo Wars. <laughs> we'll see <laughs> In, in the defense of, obviously a joke, but a good one, because he did take all of our money, um, <laughs> Sonic has never won at Combo Breaker. So oh, that's right. He lost to Dizzy in 2015, oh, true, and yeah. Foxy took it last year when right, Sonic yeah. was eliminated by Raptor. So he hasn't captured a Combo Breaker title yet. Maybe that's his oh, tournament, boy. turning oh. demon, because you know a lot of top guys have that one tournament they just can't win. Uh-huh. Maybe, maybe this is okay. in the books, okay. in the cards for Sonic not to okay. win Combo Breaker. Uh, I'm I'm really happy about the characters too because they they are all different. When they first came out, I was kind of worried that some characters were like the same. Like it seemed to me at first that like Fate and Firestorm were like the same character, yeah. but that's definitely not true. They're, <laughs> not they, the they're all very different, uh, and true. nobody feels like they're just like an add-on. Like there's nobody that's like you can you could play X character, but why not just play Y? And it's yeah. like a better version of oh, X yeah, yeah, character. Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, they all seem really different, which is which is nice. Okay. I'm really happy about. About the gameplay, and definitely stoked to watch Combo Breaker. We'll yeah. talk about that in a bit, but yeah, that's that's gonna be sick for sure. Absolutely. Okay. Uh, any last w- thoughts on Injustice Two? It's a cool. I mean, there. someone asked cool. where you can buy this. You like, can't. Like, yeah, I was yeah. about to say the that's Illumin- probably... Illuminati boys. I mean, <laughs> it is what it is. What you, can't, you can't buy this. I'm I mean, sitting next to Ultra Deep, and I'm learning. Uh, I mean, this thing looks nice, but I mean, come on, look at this, dude. I mean, like, I mean this man. guy rode a horse <laughs> in water. Look, you can get this at Banana Republic. Um, <laughs> this guy yeah, I know, but see, if I put that on and the chain, I would look like a damn fool. <laughs> you make that look. You make that look. Can we make that happen? Alternate costume, James. Can we do that? Do the people at home want to see alternate costume, James, right, with okay. the gold chain buttoned up that real smooth so and the sense. polka dots? Do you think he could pull it off? I think he could. Sure, why not? We'll even get you different colors. So right. You're a Street Fighter guy. We'll get you 10 skin. colors. It's a premium skin. Yeah. <laughs> 10 oh, colors. Oh, it's a premium, premium skin. skin. There yeah. you go. 15, that, 20, 30 Capcom colors. That DLC support, right? Yeah, for like CPT. Season yeah, 2, exactly. limited edition time. Okay. <laughs> yeah. We'll put the James Chen skin on which character, though? It's, oh, like, it, it, it's not just that you have to buy it. It's also that you have to spend at least an hour in the gym every day in order to make it happen. Yeah. So it's, a big, it's a big cost. Yeah, <laughs> it's a big, I don't know, It's not man. just the shirt. I don't know what you're talking about, Dave. <laughs> I would just say simply, man, just follow all the NetherRealm channels, you know, Twitter and at Injustice Gaming, Twitch, because they'll be streaming from there. Um, all the TOs, you know, Combo Breaker, all the events, premieres, rankings around the world. Uh-huh, uh-huh. The EU guys sign up for Path to Pro out there in Europe, uh, Liga Latina down in Latin America, and the uh, GameStop Hometown Heroes program, eight regions. Select the region you live in, please, because if you make <laughs> regional finals, let's say if you live in Texas and you sign up for Seattle, if you make regional finals, you have to fly yourself to Seattle. And if you go there and get blown up by illusions or something, just make it easy on yourself. Ten weeks online. That'll be fun every Sunday. Uh, Stream.me, War of the Gods. That's happening too. 
every Saturday with Top 8s on Tuesdays. That's a Godlight, run by a Godlight team. So there's so many different ways to get engaged with Injustice 2 online and off. And just, just type it or just tweet at me or ask anybody in the community. We'll guide you and we'll help and welcome you and easily accessible. And we'll teach you all the ins and outs if, if, if you want to play, man. It's, we're welcoming, that's for sure. Okay. There's an Ultra Chan TV guild, but it filled up in a day. So There you go. Sorry. No I'm leasing off David for free. You know, you know what's funny? <laughs> he didn't make it in. I bought it. Fact. I, 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 don't you have to be like level five to get into yes, a guild? Yes, you do. So I'm still at level zero. Dude, there's wow. a debated guild out in Florida, <laughs> and that filled up with like a uh, day too. Well, I, I saw that uh, Flo's guild got to like number three. Like what? for a while, Maximilian's yeah. guild was number one. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. And then at some point, like last time I saw it was a tweet from Flo, and it was like Fliga Nation, I think, was at, uh, <laughs> at like uh, third spot. Dang. Yeah, man, yeah. get that gear, man. It's, it's the way to do it. Dude, so how do you so score points gear. as a guild? Uh, how do you score points in a guild? There are lots of achievements that are like in the guild, and it's like beat a boss yep. in the multiverse or play against somebody from another guild or oh, play against okay. somebody in your guild. There's a ton of different <laughs> things you can do. Locals. But as <laughs> as you do it, you're getting these boxes and the boxes are what you get geared through. So you yeah. have to open a box and you get a certain number of gear. Right. Big ones. But man, when I first logged back in to the guild after getting 50 people, which is the maximum. Uh, uh, you got like a thousand boxes. I was just pressing X. <laughs> Just, yeah, like, it's, so, it's torturous. Boxes, X, you get X, so just, much. Like I was literally watching Netflix and just doing this. <laughs> just you needed for to do like the, five minutes. Just getting you need to do the, the old school Final Fantasy one buying potion strategy. <laughs> is where you get a turbo controller and put a chair on top there of the button, go. the chair leg. Dude. Maybe I use a one stick. Of those, one of those use little, a stick. Uh, use a turbo stick. Water things, the little water ducks. You know. Yes. I mean, I don't know if people haven't played Final Fantasy one. You could not choose to buy more than one item. So if you wanted 99 potions, it was, thank you, thank you. Yeah, forget all that. that you can keep terrible. that. Yeah. You should actually thank your guild that allowed you to come up with all these loadouts that, you know, you started totally. desperately. Sure. Yeah, so give a personal <laughs> shout out sure. to your thank guild you. because yeah. you allowed him to come up with Canadian like, Tuxedo. I had like 80 boxes and Bonanza. Though. And yeah. Bonanza. Bonanza, excuse me. Yeah. Bonanza. Bonanza. This guy. Go ahead. <laughs> he's got a bone mask, and he's got bones on his shoulders, and he's got bones on his wrists, and he's got bones on his legs. External bones, not just the internal bones. Extra bones. Okay. It's pretty cool. Uh, okay. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> uh, I guess we should take a break. Oh, I even forgot to highlight that whole topic mm -hmm. there. Phew, there we go. Um, all right. Uh, I guess we can take a quick break, and when we come back, uh, we'll talk about the tournament results from this weekend. Okay. Cool. Cool. Be Absolutely. right back, guys. <laughs> 